to our studio. This is what you often don't get to see because everyone wants to make it seem so magical, but we like to be real too. So this is our studio. Um, Ted mentioned on our last live video that we actually live in an old church and that is why we have big spaces, tall ceilings. Yes, those are really tall ceilings. And a uh, little bit about this, sh this place before um, it became a studio slash home. It was also the Ohio Sew Shop. And that was my first place of employment when I moved to Ohio in 2007. And Ted and his dad owned it. Okay, that was the other part. That's probably more exciting than me working here. Um, so around the studio, you'll see everything. Like, let me just point this out over here, Ted. So we have all these stands and stuff. At one point in time, so we had, we had this light stand, like this, like a Walmart $10 stand. And we had it attached to like this one right here. It was all taped up because that was on wheels. And that was like our moving lights. I mean, we were doing our best to do what we, what we had. And um, so we have some like proper stage lights. And Ted, because he actually owns a recording studio, that's why we have so many cords around here that are actual legit professional cords. Okay, so Ted's gonna come over here now, and we're gonna go to the, the Ted area. Okay, so he does, there's so many things going on over here. He's got his iPad here. This was a Ted cam that so many of you loved. You can't see it now except for his, for his fingerprints. Yes. Um, oh, there it is. We got the earth going on. So this is how he controls everything. Okay, that'll be a... Yeah, I don't know if that makes any sense. Anyway, this is where he hits what, what he wants to come up on your screen. Isn't that kind of cool? Blah, blah, blah. All right. Okay, so that's that control. Then over here we have the sound control. This screen, like, basically tells us what he's playing on his accordion. It's his newest and latest thing. For any accordion player out there that wants to know more... Um, I'll tell you. He'll tell you. I'll just put it that way. All right, hear about this. About what? Oh, you're going to tell us right now? Sure. Oh, okay. Well, this is going to be a long video. No, okay. we're going to keep it simple. But um, So Molly showed you the audio and how that kind of goes. So we use our regular mixer like we use when we play our gigs. And then beyond that, then it goes out to this. And this uh, has a little USB output that runs into the iPad. That's how all the audio gets delivered. For those of you who are wondering who's playing the bass... It is all MIDI, so Musical Instrument Digital Interface, which was started back in the 1980s, blah, blah, blah. What I'm actually using is I have mounted in my rack here, I have a Mac Mini computer. And that Mac Mini computer has sounds on it. And so you can see I program it so that way I can hear strings or vibes or steel guitar, piano, play, play the bass, the chords, all that different stuff. But... That is, in a nutshell, kind of how our mixer works, and it's all controlled via another iPad. So you can make adjustments on the sound, uh, turn things up or down, add effects. That's kind of how that works. Yeah. So, a little okay. behind the scenes for you. Yep. So then we have our collection of instruments here. Most of them are here, not all of them. Um, between the accordions, the clarinets, the saxophones. Some of them, like... I have two saxophones that I intend to basically use for recordings, and so they, they sit here otherwise, and they don't go on the road. I have a valve trombone. Everyone always asks me, what's up with this? It's a trombone with valves. It's called a valve trombone! <laughs> okay, so um, that's all it is. It's just, I like it. I actually really enjoy my enjoy playing that. Um, this concertina, Ted promises he will play this someday. He's yes. actually very good at the concertina. Um, so for that's a couple measures. Over. <laughs> no, you're good. It's a hand go concertina. We got lots of button accordions. We even got a Cajun, a Cajun style accordion back there. It's a single row. It's hard to see, but single there row. Go. It's got everything. Um, yeah. So that's that. There's that's so then, for the instruments. Okay. Yeah. So that's what the instruments. Of course, Molly's you know piano is here, sax and trumpet. Yes. Um, for some music and some notes for, for the different things. Maria. Yes. Uh, we get we keep track of all of the requests that people make. So. Uh, Molly's got a listing here of uh, other requests requests that people email us or message to us that they want to hear. And we do our best to get all those in, of course. So for those of you who are curious, this right here is what you see when you're Molly B. Yeah. You see the vocal mic, the piano, and the big TV screen. And what's the big TV screen doing? Well... It is our way to keep track of the requests. We actually have it hooked into another laptop, 
and then that laptop broadcasts there to the TV so we can see everybody's comments. Mm-hmm. So there you go. There is your tour and... Uh, lighting. Oh, lighting. Yeah. How much do you want me to say about... No, it was in the way. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> don't back up too far. You're going to hit chords. Um, so I don't know how many of you have actually taken um, studio tours, like Warner Brothers Studios or some other stage tours, but I got to be honest, this reminds me of it. You see the, cl the scene itself is fairly picked up and then everything else is just... There's so many things in this room. Um... Everything from, there's a fake beard over there to our lighting that is everything from home style lighting to actual professional lighting. Um, you know, even when it comes down to instruments, I got my train whistle. I mean, those are all necessary, right? <laughs> but it's kind of cool that we have this here and this is, this is what we do. And so when we are doing our more, our videos that are theatrical, um, we make do with things you actually find in your house because that's, that's where we're at. We're actually at our home in a studio. So it's cool. So ask us questions if you want. Musicians, I maybe you learn something too. Like, oh, that's cool. That's how they do their sound. Ted's very good at that. And um, yeah, that's it. Okay. Anything else, Ted, you want to say? I think that's all for now, but we'll have more updates as time goes by. But this yes. is kind of behind the scenes of one of our live videos. So, oh, and, and the cameras. You know what? That's an interesting thing. I don't know uh -huh. if people realize this. The cameras, we are actually recording on our iPhones. iPhones. We have these little uh, stand or these little clips over here that we clip our iPhones onto. And that is actually what is broadcasting the audio, yeah. believe it or not. Yes. So. We've, we've learned that actually iPhones, especially the newest ones, are just as good as most cameras out there. So if that is something you want to get into, if you have an iPhone, you can be doing a lot of what we're doing as well. So um, like I said, make and do with what we have, and that's how we bring our music to you. All right, everyone. Take care. God bless. We'll see you next time.